Hello friends, Marcy here, and let's talk uh, storage solutions for my um, 24 Colorverse Color Vent bottles and my Diamine Ink Vent bottles. So um, on the shelf, I have this tray or box atop this, and I'll show you that in a picture. Um, but I want to uh, put my phone in a holder and that way I have my hands free um, to explore how we've got this set up and some more ideas. Okay, so I'm going to turn this around. This is how I have it um, on my shelf and I'll put a picture uh, of that in here so you can see that uh, set up. And um, other options for this before I move it aside, because it, I'm not going to put it back on top of this until I store it back in the shelf. Um, this is a Galen leather box that I received a, an A5 uh, folio or something in. Um, and it, it is very sturdy, and I have it sitting inside the lid, um, so it's doubly, <laughs> doubly sturdy. Um, I also have one that is deeper that the bottles fit into if I wanted to put the lid on top uh, to secure them. So that's an option I may decide on, but I have been considering getting another acrylic tray. This is just uh, a drawer insert, um, but I wanted a smaller one for that would fit my bottles. So I'm gonna do some measurements and some shopping, and I may consider a, an acrylic tray to match the rest of my acrylic storage solutions. So I'm going to move this aside. And I've shared this in uh, a previous video with my whole ink storage cart and everything. And we may do an update on that because I have to reorganize it now that I have more inks. Okay, I didn't uh, block the top of this uh, purposely by setting the other tray back on there yet. Um, I am going to scoot this out of frame a bit just so that we can see what we find when we pull the drawers out okay and the these are sectioned these are acrylic storage trays that i purchased at michael's uh, craft store i think you can find them online i know you can order them at michael's online but i'm not sure what amazon has as far as um, duplicating the exact kind of storage system but this first row holds 20 of the diamine um, ink vent bottles so I have four remaining here, and then I just have the swatch cards here. Um, this tray would hold, the top would hold two years, because I could actually put um, four bottles here and 20 more here. I apologize for that noise as I'm moving that drawer. That's irritating me. I'm sure it is you as well. Um, so I could actually fit two years in one drawer. Right now I just have 2022 here, 2023 here. Um, the swatch cards and then I, another uh, storage idea is uh, I have my Iro Utsushi dip pens and a silicone swab that I sometimes use when uh, swatching some inks because it you can just apply the ink and rinse it off and reuse it so no waste there um, so the back trays can be used for storage of some other um, ink implements like I could put my um, Kakamori nib pens in there for storage but they're out on my desk all the time because I just about use them daily um, but they do fit if you're wondering so this is 2024 um, I've yet to make my swat swatch cards they're gonna go in this drawer um, again, each of these drawers, there's three in this set, would hold two years. So I could actually get six years of Dimine ink bottles in here. Whoa. Yes. A lot. <laughs> so um, that's just some storage solutions for the tiny little bottles. And, of course, the full-size bottles are in my um, ink storage card. And I will do an updated video on that coming soon as I reorganize. Um, but... If you have any questions, comments, or ideas to share with me, how are you storing your diamine or your Colorverse um, inks? I'd love uh, some great ideas.
And thank you for spending some of your precious moments with me. You have a blessed day. Bye-bye.